Hi guys, this is Breaker, and I'm back with what apparently is like some kind of an interesting TVT. Um, unfortunately, I didn't catch the names at the loading screen, but let me go ahead and introduce both players. Spawning is our Terran in the upper left-hand corner. His name is... Uh, TJ Winding. Sorry, doing my best to imitate the Korean GSL voices, and I'm going to try that one more time. Um, give this video a like if you guys think my voice is sexy when I'm sick. And in the lower right hand corner, spawning is our blue Terran. Viper XK. He belongs to the Punish Clan. Okay. And um, this is actually a particularly early SCV moving out. What is the what is the aim of this one? Oh, and that's a I don't know, I wanna say that's also an early SCV coming from our red Terran as well. And this this is what is this? This is Oh, this is an eight 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 because the supply depot went down at eight supply. We see that oh barracks is in construction right here and um refinery wow okay um uh, oh but oh wait wait what is this red scv gonna do here oh oh he has no vision of the high ground that's actually oh no he didn't he didn't actually send his scv up there i think it might have been a better idea for him just to send the scv up here but of course this is the i want to say one of the closest bare minimum distances that you can send an scv out to scout your opponent's main and natural without scouting the barracks here, but unfortunately, the barracks here gives vision to the barracks being constructed down here. Actually, it's not the barracks so much, but rather the SCV on the barracks is doing it. And now, we actually see Winding in a bit of trouble. His opponent's barracks has finished just before his, and he did not see it. He has no clue how his opponent saw that. But, um, here we go. SCV chasing SCV, and right now, if we just look at the worker count for a moment, we see that the income for Viper K is actually lagging quite a bit far behind. But um, behind that, he goes ahead and cancels his barracks, and how's he gonna follow this up? Oh, with the command center. That's um, pretty risky, considering we actually have a Reaper on the way. Wow. And Viper XK just says, hey, 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 he really needs to throw in a U in there. You know, like, quit, 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 quit. You know what? I think just one quit would be more than enough. But, um, he's gonna go in here and he's really gonna cause some damage with that one Reaper that he's got in production. His opponent never scouted that barracks. And, oh, wait, what's going on here? Oh, oh, th this... He, he thinks he's got a really standard opening coming here, but it's actually a double, I guess you could say, proxy... I wouldn't say double proxy racks, but a proxy... A hidden racks that's got a closer, uh, rally point than the one at the natural, and um, now we actually see winding in a bit of trouble. He's had to pull SCVs. If we just check the income right now, that is a huge difference. And I mean, if we just look at the worker count right now, sure, winding is ahead, but the question is, when's he going to have defensive forces out to deal with that? He's he's had his barracks done for a while, but his mechanics, he's just... He's had to basically try to micro these SCVs, but it's not going to work, and ouch, there goes another worker from... E from winding or ouch another two how many workers have been killed now five altogether including that one that was building the uh, barracks at the beginning and here we go three reapers versus one marine what is going on here you know is this going to be enough micro just what's going on here because I know the reapers actually are a bit more tanky than marines when they first get built and it looks like this marine is going to kill one reaper but now there are four reapers and one marine and if Viper K goes in right now with these Reapers, he is, I think he's pretty much set to win the game. He, his opponent, you know, he just doesn't have any more Marines in production. He doesn't have any more out on the map, which is actually quite critical. That one Marine falls, and now we have four Reapers kiting all these SCVs. This is good game, guys. There's no way you can come back from this. He says, damn on you, and he was defeated. He left the game. Was that the, that was the second time he said that. So I'm thinking, okay, maybe this was on the uh, EU server. I don't know, maybe he's gonna go back and check the replay and just think, man, I am so dumb for not spotting for not spotting that. Anyway, if you guys liked what you saw here, just uh, go ahead and give me some love. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button. That would be below the screen that you're looking at right now on YouTube. This has been Breaker, and I will see you guys next time.